Hello, Joe Gaming Girlie here. Um, yeah, I'm not sure how I'm going to title this video yet, but these are games that I've always wanted to try. Uh, they're my usual type of games. Um, as you all know, I love survival horror and just horror games. They're my favourite. Um, I also like um, adventure games and just puzzles, puzzly games. I'm trying to think what else really. <laughs> you know, I like games like Tomb Raider, Uncharted. Um, they're, they're some of my favourite. Um, and I like a lot of platform games as well, like Spyro, Crash, Bandicoot. Um, yeah, platformers, Sonic, you know, <laughs> things like that. Um, I, know, I, I, I like a lot of very unusual games as well. Just anything unusual and different. Um, I love hack and slash, is that it? I guess I, that's how you call it. Um, you know, I love Bayonetta, I love Heavenly Sword, I love Devil May Cry, you know, you know, there, there's loads of games that I enjoy that, you know, I like Arcade Fighters, Virtual Fighter, I love m many beat em ups as well, um, Streets of Rage and many more um yeah um so yeah these games are not my typical games basically but i've always wanted to try them because they you know they're not terrible games they're just games that aren't something that i would normally go for but anyway let's just go on it's <laughs> the best way that i can describe it i guess so the first game that i always wanted to try because uh, i love the look of it Let's just show you it first before. I... So we got Skyrim. Um, this is actually my partner's copy of Skyrim. Who and he's now he he's not a console guy. My partner he is he loves his gaming PC. Um, he's always been a computer uh, sort of gamer. <laughs> um, so yeah. This is my copy now, <laughs> and actually a couple of these are his, <laughs> what I'm going to show you today, but yeah, Skyrim. Now, I absolutely love the look of this game, so uh, this is my partner's, but as well. <laughs> so yeah, it's this amazing art book, can you see? Isn't that gorgeous? Anyway, inside there's just, a, you know, there's just amazing artwork, like, within this book. So much artwork, that's amazing, and different environments, and basically I was just like, you know, reading through this, um, and it is just, you know, it's amazing, this artwork is just, I mean, look at this, you know, and it got me really interested in what you know, dragons oh my god i mean there's dragons i've always been uh, into dragons since a very you know young age so you know i actually collected a lot of dragons back when i was uh young loads and loads of dragon ornaments and stuff like that but i mean look at this like, artwork oh my god it's amazing you know, it's just brilliant. I mean, I'm sorry, I'm looking through that. I'm going to be doing a video. <laughs> it's a very good book, that um, that art book. So that art book got me absolutely interested in playing this game. Um, and also, it's quite sort of medieval -y. Um There's a lot of, you know, medieval-style buildings. Um, a lot of the armour is quite medieval. And the weaponry is quite medieval as well. Um, and I love uh, castles and, you know, medieval history and stuff like that. So, yeah, just... And also dragons. <laughs> so, yeah. And I have actually played this. Um, and it did get quite far. I have, I, I've stopped playing it. Because obviously it's a really huge game. Um, and you need to put in a lot of time. Which I sadly do not have as you well know. Um, so I tend to play really short games, um, and this is so huge, there's so many different side quests and 
I get easily distracted. I was trying to stick to the main story of the game, but you, you really can't do that in this game. I was just like, oh, side quests. I'm going like this way. Ooh, side quests that way. Ooh, <laughs> you know, and <laughs> I like trying to stick to the story because I'm never going to complete this. Um, it's long enough as, as it is. If you stick with just the story of this game, it's long enough. Um, but going and doing all these different side quests and exploring, there's just so much to explore. It's beautiful. The environments are beautiful. And I'm just like, yeah, I got a little bit addicted to playing this. Um, I will come back to it because I never, I, I, I sort of went with a character that was a bit more sort of, um, well, I was dual wielding some, was it axes or something? I was dual wielding a weapon anyway, but I was a bit more of a warrior type person in Skyrim. But I kind of want to try, and I'm going to do another character, um, I'm not going to get rid of that save, I will come back to that, but I'm going to do a different character and uh, do sort of magic. Because uh, I never, never, ever do that. Um, but yeah, this is not usually my type of game, um, but I'm glad I tried this anyway. Um, and I will come back to it, like I say, I'm going to do a different character, just to try something different. <laughs> um, and yeah. I got like a double pack here, so yeah, <laughs> and it actually comes out comes with Skyrim. <laughs> I got two Skyrim. Anyway, so I actually decided to play Fallout Four, and I suppose this is kind of my kind of game. It's a survival game in a way, isn't it? I suppose. Um, and there's zombies in this, <laughs> which made me happy so many of them um but yeah this game oh i absolutely love this game um and i have stopped playing this as well because again it's a really big long game with loads of side quests you do need to spend some a good amount of hours it's 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 not a short game if you do everything um but yeah i think i'm gonna go back to playing this again i'm gonna leave skyrim for a bit but I will come back to this because I, I really, I was very surprised. I really enjoyed Fallout 4. Um, but a lot of people say I should try Fallout Vegas on PS3, uh, which I have on PS3 actually. Um, and I, I think I will have a go on that as well. But I'm, I'm going to come back to this because I really, really enjoyed it. I enjoyed it more than I thought I would. Um, and the same with Skyrim. I enjoyed it more than I thought it would. These are not my typical kind of games that I would go for um, so yeah um, I also tried another game that I always wanted to try was Dark Souls um, yeah uh, <laughs> um, I didn't get on with it. it it's not a terrible game it's just yeah it's hard um, I don't care, I admit it, it's hard, um, and you die a lot. <laughs> um, I feel like I could get good at it, but again, it's a game that I need to put in a lot of hours, even more than these two, I feel, um, and yeah, I just, I just don't have the time. Um, yeah, I feel like I could get good at that over time. Um, I think it is a game where you sort of die and you learn, and you die and you learn, and you get further and further each time. Um, but yeah, I just, I just didn't enjoy it. I don't think I enjoy dying loads of times. <laughs> um, I just feel like, yeah, just it just wasn't for me, Dark Souls, but I'm glad I tried it. Um, Skyrim, it doesn't matter if you play any of the other sort of games you know any of the elder scroll you know like oblivion and you could just jump straight into this game um and yeah um but yeah there's other ones um obviously um which i need to probably try um yeah i i, I don't know it <laughs> 
like I say, um, I, I felt like these were easy to get into. If you, and I mean, I, I never played any of the other Fallout games. Never played any of the, you know, I just jumped straight into Skyrim. I just jumped into 4 and yeah, I was fine. I didn't need to play any of the others um, beforehand. So, yeah. <laughs> but Dark Souls, mm, didn't get on with it, sadly. Um, anyway, um, another game. I'm trying to see what ones I should show next. But, a yeah, uh, this has been in my collection for a very long time. This Final Fantasy anthology. It's been in my collection forever. Um, I'm... I always like the look of Final Fantasy, like the artwork. I mean, look at that. It's beautiful. I always appreciate the artwork. I love how gorgeous the games look and the cool characters and the enemies, but yeah, I've never played any Final Fantasy game. Uh, this is actually a game I got for free way back. It's been in my collection for a very, 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 very long time. Um, but yeah, and I just because it's not my typical game, I just kind of left it there, <laughs> not touched it and not bothered playing it. Um, yeah, I got this way back, um, back when people were chucking PlayStation 1 games away, and I used to come home with like bags of PlayStation 1 games for free, so this is one of the free ones, um, and a couple more there are free, um, but I did buy some of those, <laughs> not all, but yeah. I was very lucky <laughs> to get a lot of because PlayStation games are very costy these days, aren't they? But anyway, so I tried. What one was it? Oh yeah, this one. So basically, played this one. Um, so what do I think about it? Um, <laughs> yeah, it's something different. <laughs> I'm not sure yet. Um, I have got quite far. Um, yeah, I was kind of... I was trying to defeat this dragon. I think it was like a crystal dragon. And I had to go through this, like, cave or something. Um, but every time I was trying to defeat this, like, boss... I guess it's like a boss, because it was a lot bigger than the other enemies. I just kept dying. <laughs> and I was like, hmm... I'm not sure, because I just know absolutely nothing about how you play. I don't know nothing about Final Fantasy at all. And um, what I figured out is I probably have to keep defeating the lower enemies to, I guess, get stronger, My get my character to be a lot stronger to be able to defeat this bigger enemy. And it worked. Um, so I'm guessing that's what I do. I have no idea. I don't know nothing about these style of games. Um... But I'm learning as I'm playing it, and yeah, I'm really enjoying it, and I got quite far, like I say, I got past that dragon in the end. <laughs> it took me like three or four tries. Um, yeah, got past that dragon, and yeah, I got past, and I went through the cave bit, and got to a village, and yeah, it, it, I, I do enjoy it. Um, I'm gonna, I think I'm just gonna carry on playing, oh, the music, oh my god, the music in this game is epic, I, I, it just makes me want to play more, I'm just like, duh, duh, duh. this music is very enjoyable, um, it's probably not the best game to play first, um, like I said, I don't know nothing about Final Fantasy, um, anyway, my partner has, had, has this game, this is his copy, but now my copy because he doesn't play consoles and he says I can have this. Um, I found out this is probably the best one to play. So yeah, I guess this is going to be on my list to play next. I'm going to carry on playing um, this one. This Final Fantasy. Um, and... Yeah, I'll show you the inside, actually. It's really mint. Look at that book. So, yeah, I'll carry on playing this one. And, yeah, I'm just I'm just going to complete it. <laughs> I decided. Um, and then I'll 
jump and play this one. I, I should really maybe pick up a modern day Final Fantasy on PS4 perhaps and see what a modern day Final Fantasy is like. Um, yeah, so these are games I always wanted to get into um, and yeah, I'm really glad I tried it at last because like I say, this, is, this has been in my collection for so embarrassing but <laughs> you know it's not my typical game so that's what I, did. I don't know why I didn't didn't just sell this you know but I'm glad I didn't um I am enjoying this and I think I'm going to continue and complete that move on to that <laughs> anyway last this is something I haven't played yet um but I will do uh, this is on my list. Well, I literally haven't got much of a list now. I literally, I've played all the games that I wanted to. I played Fallout, I played Skyrim, I played Dark Souls, um, and I tried Final Fantasy. So, yeah, this is literally something. The only one I need to check out now is uh, Dead Space. Um, yeah, many people said I should try this. I really like this, being that it's a survival horror in space wow so um yeah i've got i've got all of them i've even got the nintendo wii dead space game um yeah i'm going to play these eventually um and i can't wait to try it um very much so i mean this is so mint this copy it's like oh brand new um yeah i did really well getting these um they were cheap and really minty all of my Dead Spaces that I've got, including the Nintendo Wii one. So yeah, the only games I'm gonna, these are the only two that I'm gonna try out that I've never, I mean this, I feel like this is probably more my cup of tea than, you know, I mean Fallout, Skyrim and, and Final Fantasy are not my typical usual games really, but Dead Space is because it's a survival horror. So I think I would definitely love this game. Um, many people recommended me this game. Anyway, this video is... I don't know what this video is. <laughs> but there you go. Um, but yeah, that I've been really enjoying. Um, I mean, that's what I've been playing. What's this? <laughs> um, and yeah, a lot of pinball games. I've been enjoying my pinball games. Um, and I've been playing my Switch a lot can't tell you what game it is because I will do a pick up soon when I get a bit more games. I haven't got that many, I've only got like two and I'm sort of playing one of them right now. So I can't tell you what I'm playing but it's so good. I'm loving the Switch. Um, but yeah, I don't think there's any other games that I've always wanted to try but haven't yet. Those are the ones. Um, but yeah, um, I really... <laughs> Like I say, Final Fantasy, I really do want to get into Final Fantasy games. I don't know what it is. I, just, I think I just love the gorgeous artwork. And yeah, I'm enjoying this so far. So hopefully I'll play this and complete this and play this one. And then I will grab like a, a newer Final Fantasy and play that also. And I mean, there's so many Final Fantasy games. It's a little bit oh my god it's not probably the best idea to get into final fantasy games because there's just so many it's like where do you even start um uh, well you know i love playstation one a whole lot so i'll probably start with all the playstation one final fantasies maybe i don't i i don't know nothing about final fantasy i don't think it matters what game i play I think you could just jump into whatever game, hopefully. I don't know if they have connecting stories or whatever. Um, I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> let me know. If you if you know anything about Final Fantasy, let me know down in the comments. Anything, you know, what game should I play in a row? What should I start with? Because um, I know absolutely nothing. And I would love to get... I really would love to get real get into Final Fantasy because like I say it is gorgeous um and Fallout's gorgeous and Skyrim's gorgeous um so yeah I can't wait to play more 
of these games and get more into them, play, you know, the other games in the franchise of Fallout and, you know, and all that, you know? Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. <laughs> but yeah, I've been alright. Um, it's been a hard couple of weeks. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna. Yeah, no. Um, don't really talk about personal things, really. Um, yeah, it's been. Oh, it's been a really hard one. It's been a very stressful one. It's been a very emotional week. And tiring. And yeah. Um, I'm all good. We're back. And yeah, we're going to carry on creating. I mean, I'm really enjoying YouTube. And yeah, it's really good, like, creating videos. Um. And, uh, you know, it's just nice. I can just... Ooh, it's Friday. Time to chill. <laughs> Relax. Make a video. Um, yeah, it's very, very relaxing doing this. Which is a good thing, so I need, need to de-stress. I had a hard week. I had a hard week. And last week was very hard as well. Oh. And, yeah. Time to chill. Friday and chillin'. Uh, yeah, so what I'm gonna do after this video, well, I'm gotta put this up, obviously, for Friday, um, but I think I'm gonna do some more reading. I'm sort of reading the Resident Evil books at the moment. I'm reading this Resident Evil book. Um, I think the next one is The City of the Dead after this, um, but as you can see, I'm nearly done. It won't take me long to read that last bit. And then we're done with this one. We can move on to the next um, video. Video? Ugh. Next book. <laughs> um, and yeah, that will be The City of the Dead. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to finish this book. I'm going to make some more jewellery. And... I'm going to play some games um, and relax and uh, it's going to be a good day. It's going to be a good day. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching and bye.